Hey guys, in today's video, we're going to be looking at the cut and go scale features located on your LaserWorks panel. And this will be for TrueCut already works. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za. We make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise, back in the program here. Now, um, just a quick reminder, this is a mini series on your LaserWorks uh, panel. We'll also leave relevant links in the description. Now, if for some reason you do not see it, you can always go to view and then you go to process control bar. And then just um, uh, select the visibility there. Now, when it comes to our next option here, which is the cut scale and go scale, these buttons here on the bottom right of the feature um, in my opinion I would probably put the ghost scale on top of the cut scale so what the, uh, it will do we'll start with the go scale so now the go scale will basically um, when you click that it will give you a prompt of the uh, way you can set the movement speed and like width and so forth for blank space and that will basically make a rectangle around your design which in my case will be this top as well but just for demonstration i made it here so you'll basically be able to set the movement speed and so forth of this so what this will do is it will kind of simulate you can say um, a cut of like a boundary box so let's say you're making a design here and you want a little boundary box so you cut it out on then you set it there so this will only move the laser head not the actual laser itself so it won't cut it will only simulate it then if you use the next option, the cut scale, then it will have um, similar options, but you'll obviously be able to set the minimum and maximum, sorry, minimi, <laughs> minimum and maximum power of the laser. So then, um, and that one will actually then cut the rectangle around. So that's pretty much what the cut scale and go scale um, features do. Just a quick recap again. So the bottom one, the go scale will simulate the rectangle with your laser head. And the cut scale will actually use the laser to cut the rectangle. Otherwise, yeah, if we had to head here to softwaretraining.co.za, you guys will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover. And also, you can isolate your search on the top right. If you do not, however, find what you're looking for, just go here, request a training video. Then we will make that video for you. But otherwise, thanks guys for watching and cheers.